what's up guys thanks so much for clicking on another video of mine unless it's your first time here in which case please subscribe I've got a lot of really great content and I'd love for you to check it out I'm here today to show you a really cool tool it's been a really long hot week in the shop We've got a lot of work done the shop is messy there's tools everywhere I've got to do some cleaning over the weekend here but I wanted to show you guys a tool that has made my life so much easier and that is the DeWalt portable bandsaw actually a portable bandsaw in general a few years ago when I first started knife making I was trying to fit myself out with the right tool set and it seemed like a lot of guys were doing stock removal type blades by using a porta band either clamped in a in like a swag table or I, I clamped mine in my wood vise so I invested in the Milwaukee deep cut porta band the five inch cut and it was just a game changer. I had never known anyone with a portable bandsaw. I had never seen one used in person. I would never worked in the trades in terms of any metal work or anything like that. So I would never seen one used, only on videos. And it blew my mind. And now just recently I've been eyeing this model. Because I was saying to myself, you know the perfect tool this Milwaukee uh, portable bandsaw that I have there the only thing that could make it better is if you weren't tied to a cord on the end and this is it right here DeWalt delivered this is actually a sponsored video by DeWalt they actually sent me this tool which I am really really grateful for it's uh, really helped my project work especially with working on the flatbed project right now a lot of you guys have been commenting over the past year. I've actually received a bunch of messages and comments suggesting that I had been sponsored. Sorry, a bunch of mosquitoes here in the shop. The door was just open. Guys saying that I've been sponsored by DeWalt because of all the DeWalt reviews and tools all over the wall and, and the different things I'm using this DeWalt. This, honest truth, this is the very first thing I've ever received from DeWalt. Every DeWalt tool I've had here, because people are saying, ah, I knew you weren't buying all those tools on your own. Every DeWalt tool you've ever seen on this channel has been purchased by me or occasionally my dad if we brought one of, his, one of his DeWalt tools on the channel for review. All bought with my own very hard earned money. So don't think we've been handed out a shop full of freebies. I am genuinely a lover of DeWalt tools and I'm just really thankful once again that they've sent along this portable bandsaw. So let's have a look here. What do we have? This is also the deep cut model. So five inch cut here, which is beautiful. I have never had anything to cut larger than this. The closest I've come, it was cutting the back bumper off of the Vandura. I think it's the safer route. These blades run under very high tension these, it's not like a, a wood band saw, they actually don't have a lot of flex, and of course just like any other band saw you can get a whole range of different teeth. I think I'm running 18 here now, which seems to work, anything 14, 18, 24, right around that range has worked real nice for me. Back here you have that nice over molded grip, over molded rubber grip like we know and love from DeWalt, they do a really good job of that variable speed which is very useful as well trigger lockout which with my little kitties around <laughs> is very important I'm really working to get in the habit every time I lay down a tool throw on my trigger lockout just in case little hands come along and grab hold they, I'm teaching them not to do that never touch power tools when they're sitting on the bench but just in case Blade tracking adjustment, this is your blade tensioner right here, simple flip and close and your tool built right in here that you need for your adjustment. Battery right here. This model comes with a hook 
for hooking on uh, like a, a piece of material or work surface. If you have a cutting table, it works great. This is how I've been hanging it up with this hook. Very convenient. One thing I really like about this one that my Milwaukee does not have is this adjustable front handle. This is great. It makes better ergonomics for different size folks and different angles that you might be working at. It's a very robust type system. Really deep locking mesh. So it's not something that like real fine splines that can give out on you. That is a really nice feature as well. Now it's just a matter of snapping your battery pack. Notice it sits in a location that's not in your way. And we have a running bandsaw. Notice this light here. DeWalt does a good job of adding LED lights to all its tools, which is a very nice feature, especially on the, I, not as much, or haven't used it much on this one, it hasn't been much of a requirement, but on like my drills and impact drivers and stuff, very handy. You're driving a screw in the back of a closet or something like that, awesome. Now when it comes to cutting steel, which is what I have this for, you basically have a couple options. You can use something like a reciprocating saw, which with a, with a good steel blade, works quite well for different cutting projects. Although definitely not my favorite. Works good for like exhaust pipe and stuff like that, but I don't enjoy it for cutting like angle iron and flat bar. It's messy, it moves around a lot. I'm just not a fan of the reciprocating saw. Of course the bread and butter option is gonna be the angle grinder. Now I have a lot of angle grinders. Each one of my angle grinders is a different brand name, doesn't matter. I like to have multiples because I like one chocked up with a flat wheel and one with a grinding disc and one with a cutting disc and one with a wire brush wheel. It's just really handy. I got really tired of always switching out, although I tend to run the DeWalt battery one a lot, so I'm switching out a lot now anyways because I'm doing a lot of work outside on the vendor and stuff. I don't like running the cords. But the angle grinder is much slower for cutting produces a lot lower quality cut, and it's a lot more messy and more dangerous. Now, I'm sure anyone who has been around an angle grinder operating can understand what I mean by more mess and more dangerous situation. Take this scenario right here, cutting the running boards off the Vandura. It wasn't a big deal about the sparks, so we just dealt with it. But this is the kind of result you can expect when cutting with an angle grinder. Now, I don't like to produce that kind of amount of spark inside my workshop. I have wood walls in the workshop. My shop is connected to my house. I try to cut with a grinder like this very minimally because those sparks get thrown into dust pits in the corner and get thrown into scraps of wood piles, and it can be a danger. Occasionally, you even get a, a situation where you're cutting metal and it's very dangerous to use an angle grinder and this is a scenario right here when we were deconstructing the Vandura we actually had to remove an old propane line and I didn't have a lot of knowledge on how well the line was bled or anything like that so in case there were any lingering vapors I did not want to guarantee a shower of sparks being thrown around the bandsaw I have never seen in all my years of using them I've never seen produce a spark very slow and methodical cutting blade and it doesn't produce sparks even though I don't recommend you do this at home like I said I've never seen an issue so if you're watching this video on the day that I put it up it is Father's Day weekend and I decided to upload this review now because DeWalt along with a lot of other tool makers tend to have a lot of good sales discounts coupons and stuff on Father's Day weekend. So what better time to nab yourself one of these if you do much fab work, if you're doing a little home DIY welding projects or working on vehicles, building exhausts, motorcycles, different things like that. I'm telling you, one of these will be a game changer. I know it was for me just a, a mind-blowing tool and totally changed my perception of how you can cut and play with steel. It's just really beautiful. Hope you enjoyed this video. Hit that like button if you did. Leave me a comment down below. Tell me what you think. Tell me if there's any unique uses you can think of using one of these for. Subscribe if it's your first time here. Big thank you for watching. Big thank you to DeWalt for sponsoring this video by sending in this awesome tool. Happy Father's Day. Have a wonderful day.